Okay, let's try this again. This time, hopefully, it does not just completely fuck me over. That'd be nice. Yeah. I, I don't think I actually went this way, that but oh well. Uh, no, nothing. Oh, th th yeah, the... Isn't this the place where, like, I've been getting numbers for these people? Like a family? Like, uh, saying they're gonna hide probably. out here? I think that's what this was. Alright, let's... Maybe like, yeah. hey, each one of us members of the family knows one digit of the code. If yeah. Die, no one ever get into the code ever. Yeah. And then they had a falling out. Yes. <laughs> yeah, and then they have a falling out, and they go to the four corners corners of the world. Damn it! Who is shooting me? It was a me? fun time. You know what the I hell? I actually wonder if if Asia actually is on the exact opposite end of the world as the United States. You could always look at a globe to figure that out. I know, but those aren't, well, actually, yeah, they are, but I, can't, <laughs> I, I don't own a globe, so I, I'm left to wonder. I think, wonder. like, if you're on the eastern coast, it is, but it's not for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you go through the planet, you'll go in the water. Oh, no. And all that work I had to get through, uh, through the center of the planet. All for <laughs> naught. <laughs> <laughs> yes, all for naught. Oh, it's it's just locked. Like I can pick it open. Yeah. So then. Uh, it's not like digging through the entire planet is incredibly difficult and or impossible or anything. <laughs> I mean, the you door. Dream big. The door is activated elsewhere. You just told me it was a very hard lock, and now they're like, "Ah, oh, no, it's just no, kidding." No, I said it was locked very heavily. I didn't say about a very hard lock. No, that's what they said. Uh, Speaking of which, well, where is uh, Fox? I think it's supposed to be a computer somewhere that opens it up or whatever. Where Where did Fox go? He has always, not. Always in it. Yeah. He has not. I always made. hated this place. It's always confusing as hell. Mm. If I blow up the generator, will I activate the door? <laughs> no. If not, that was sure pretty. That was very pretty. Yes, explosions you are very pretty. You know what I don't understand though. I see how strong Fox looks, right? Right. Why doesn't he? You see, just bend the metal. Why doesn't he <laughs> just punch it and then rip it off? Just like. Shut up! Yeah. Just because I have, yeah. just because I can launch mini nukes, doesn't mean I can go through wooden doors. Oh, here's a here's a terminal. Over here. Oh, hey, look at that! Oh, it's the turret control system. All right, I think I got this one, no problem. Allowance, damn it! Hit the allowance replenish, but I haven't done one yet. Okay, it's not slithered. Therefore, it's not sanctuary. I'm trying to do this as fast as I can. Um, yeah, these bits are always a bit slow, but hey, man, dude, that one, that dud you just hit, kind of looks like boobies. <laughs> <laughs> you are a desperate, desperate man. <laughs> <laughs> is it my fault that I noticed these things? I don't think so. There you go, monster. I think it is a little bit. A little bit. Not too much, uh, but a little bit. Okay, whoever's watching this video right now, make a comment <laughs> right now. <laughs> then tell him that this isn't my fault. You saw so, it. Uh, you uh, did. <laughs> you know you did. If you yes. watch Baller Scuba, you know you did. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you're, you're implying that I make everybody see boobies. <laughs> Everybody sees boobies because well, they watch me. You, that's certainly one of the things I start thinking about. <laughs> Stop thinking about my boobies. They're not <laughs> for you. Oh, what's up, Vox? Where you been? What the hell is that? I, I'm sorry to say, but you're too flat for me, Baller. I'm oh, sorry. come on. I'm sorry. It's just you don't have you don't have the bam that I'm looking <laughs> for. <laughs> So okay, so apparently I do need to come back here when I have once I have the uh what do you call it? 
the numbers because I don't have the numbers. So, I don't know, maybe they're up here somewhere. That'd be awesome. So you're looking for Wall Street numbers? <laughs> I don't know. Well, the, the, the family numbers. My number is four. Oh, thank you. You might have my saved me. Seven. <laughs> <laughs> you might have saved my life by giving me a number. <laughs> it's not like I could just hit s sit there. If I've got years, right? I could just sit there and spam all the numbers. There's only there's only ten thousand of them. I know. Seriously, <laughs> it's just. Hey, I have nine. No, I have ten numbers. <laughs> I can use them eventually and find the right one. Plus, like, if when they say my number is four, they don't say, well, what order is it in? They're just yeah, like. Yeah, I know. They can just fuck with you and be like, haha, -ha, this is the series. You'll never know now. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, okay, it's four, nine, five, one. But what order? Now I gotta sit here for like ten minutes and try to figure that shit out. Like, but I tried that combination already. <laughs> it didn't work. Yeah. And then you look back and you see a troll face on their face. And oh. it's just like, oh, I see. Damn trolls, man. <laughs> Damn trolls. <laughs> Is it wrong that when when people mess with me in real life, I actually look and imagine a troll face <laughs> over there? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I just I think if I saw that in real life it would be the funniest slash scariest thing I could ever oh, see. Oh when I went to BlizzCon somebody had a car Damn it I deactivated you. Oh <laughs> Somebody had a costume that was just you know like the the black suits that um Damn it, are they still firing at me? Who was firing at me? I do not see a sentry bot anywhere. W okay, so you know the in in musical theater when they don't want you to look at somebody, they they wear like all black, like a skin tight black suit. Yeah. Yeah, he was wearing that, and then he had glued a cardboard troll face on his face. <laughs> <laughs> It was awesome. That sounds awesome, dude. It was I that guy and just shook his hand and was like, "Thank you for making the world a better place," <laughs> and then walked away. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! Now he was getting a piggy piggyback ride at the time, so I didn't, I didn't. Yeah, I only saw him as we were yeah, leaving the concert. <laughs> yes, he was. And oh my God. I will, I will try to get that picture from Buttercross because. He, I'm, I'm, I know he has it somewhere. He took a pic, but I, I didn't whip out my phone fast enough to get it. That was awesome, though. Uh, there were some good costumes. How do you find... How do you find... What is it like at BlizzCon? It's just every uh, freaky thing you can imagine it just crawls out of the works of the city to come there and party for a day. You know what? There's a lot more normal people than you would think. I mean, there, don't get me wrong, there, there are definitely some heavy nerds that I think this is their only time out of, out of their basement. But there are some, <laughs> but there are some people that you took one, if you took a look at them, you wouldn't be like, oh, this guy's obviously really into WoW. You know what I mean? There's some, there's some normal looking people there. Yeah. But they're... Well, you'd probably be among them, really, because you don't look <laughs> like a uber nerd. Oh, but I are one. Yes, you are. <laughs> and that's why I love you, Baller. <laughs> You're my uber nerd. Ow. Damn it. Uh, there was, um... Damn it. I'm using more stim packs than I thought I would. There was uh, quite a few good, uh, costumes there. The one that won was, uh, I think I told you, was Agitant, the the little thing from uh, the, the StarCraft II campaign. Agent or Ag Agent or whatever her Agitant, name Agitant, yeah. She's the one that gives you all the missions, the robot-looking thing. That that costume was awesome. Yeah, and and I, I really I really like her voice personally because <laughs> whenever I was doing something for the campaign, she was like, "Warning." <laughs> on minerals and I was like oh, okay low baby I'll, I'll <laughs> fix that for you <laughs> uh, and then there was a guy there that had a minecraft costume 
of a Blizzard character. I didn't recognize the character because I don't do WoW, but he he came out in like six cardboard boxes in the Minecraft character. <laughs> it was awesome, but he felt he fell on the stage, so uh. he couldn't. He wasn't eligible for prizes. They said because of that. Apparently. Because he fell? Because he fell. Because he couldn't see where the fuck he was going. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that happens... Oh, okay. That happens a lot when when you're wearing costumes that, honestly, you probably shouldn't be wearing. You know, I'd like to know how people like that make those costumes, because if I had any artistic talent, I, I know I would definitely go... <laughs> As a brutalisk one year, if I could, <laughs> I would definitely go as a brutalisk. Oh, uh, that would win. If you could pull off a brutalisk, that would win. A lot of people just go as, like, normal people from WoW. Like, um, oh, I'm this elf from this town, and yeah. she's the one that gives you the quest. Like, oh, that's great. And then somebody else shows up and goes, like, I'm fucking Deathwing. Like, oh, snap, he's a whole fucking dragon. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, guess which one's going to win? It doesn't matter how good your little elf costume is. You're not going to take it. No. Uh, <laughs> dude, you know what we need? We need to get, like, 20 people all working on a dragon costume <laughs> <laughs> we could make it work I know we could we just <laughs> have a giant fucking red dragon <laughs> walk into BlizzCon roar once before it collapses <laughs> and everyone would just clap and clap and clap uh, 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 there, was, there were a few people there and they took uh, I don't even know I mean people surround the people in costumes and you know get pictures with them yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Combat helmet. Uh, it does sound fun, though. It I, is. I, I do wish I had time to go do that kind of thing, but I don't know. <laughs> it, it is a lot of fun, and um, I mean, it's good for the money, you know. You're you're there for two days. Uh, it's I think it was like a hundred and seventy-five. But. Yeah. But I mean, you get a well, concert I mean, at the I end. Had cash, I'd definitely pay <laughs> for it. You get a concert at the end, and a concert by itself is going to cost you about, you know, seventy, eighty dollars. So I mean, yeah, definitely worth the money. And you got to see a bunch of demos and see some of the best costumes of this side of Halloween. Huh? Yeah, <laughs> it was. I'm pretty sure they were going to be wearing them for Halloween as well. Just a thought. <laughs> Probably, yeah. I don't know. I wish I could pull off a brutal brutalist, but only there's only two problems. One, I don't really know where I would start with that kind of thing. And two, I'm not a makeup artist. So I, wouldn't, I wouldn't be able to do much. And actually, I don't know if I'm quite big enough for that, so I might end up having to do a hydra to make it, you know, size fitting and whatever. They did have, um, because they sell stuff there a lot, um, they did have online. Apparently, I lit everything on fire. They do have online like little makeup kits for for different races in WoW. I don't know if they have that for StarCraft too, but <laughs> they did. They did well, have it for I'm a while. I'm sure somebody's tried to do a Brutalisk at one point. Those things are awesome, even though they aren't a normal unit. You know, I think they should be. They should, they should add <laughs> Brutalisk as like a not a hero unit, but like a Thor level unit or whatever. They they should be able to do that. There's I mean there's a few things that were in the campaign that never made it to the multiplayer, and you would think that that'd be an easy transition for them. 